we're going to Toyota manual selection it is a US version Toyota Camry it's a 2009 with the smart key and we're gonna go straight into control unit keyless system can and backup mobilizer data that's how you back it up once you back it up then you generate the analog key which is this thing right here and you should be able to start the car with this all right mobilizer data is being backed up right now and once it's done we should be able to burn it into this smart key over here we should be able to start the car with this and now that the backup is complete we're gonna go and generate analog key Okay, and I named it Toyota Camry right over here. All right, this function needs internet connection, so make sure you have Wi-Fi. So now that we're connected to internet, we hit OK, chicken network. I should add that we use this method um, in few cases. One, if the customer lost their key and they think they're gonna find it, whether that's in their house or somewhere else, and we don't wanna do all keys lost and delete the previous key, this method will uh, um, help us avoid that, and we could just go um, generate the key and add our new key. Or if the customer just want to start the car and move it uh, somewhere else, instead of paying for towing, you know, in case of an emergency or something like that, where they have the key somewhere else. Another reason to use this method um, over the 16 minutes ECU reset is to save time. This method should take with good internet service uh, no more than four to five minutes to perform and you have um, a key and you're able to add another one uh, instead of waiting 16 minutes with the tr normal traditional way of doing all keys lost. now pretty much burned the key into this simulator so we should be able to start it start the car like that now the car started using this right here without a key 